Okay guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Now today we are going to be talking all about the Ark Survival Ascended gameplay. Now obviously the release is, isn't even that long away now when I think about it. And I thought I'd load up Fjorda, get on Ark Survival Evolved and talk about what Wildcard have recently told us about the gameplay. Now every single time I hop back onto Ark, is, I'm not currently doing any official anything like that. It's all unofficial at the moment just because the release of Ascended is coming soon and everything. But we're going to be talking about the servers and you know and all of them closing and stuff. So if you guys do enjoy today's video and you kind of like these let's talk videos with news smash that like button subscribe if you're new to the channel you'll be seeing a lot more of these building up to the release of arc survival ascended and let's get in with the video so obviously um in the new community crunch that we covered yesterday they mentioned something about the gameplay because all of us have been asking the same sort of question when are we seeing gameplay if the release is actually for the new game august you know in august that they said why have we not seen any gameplay yet and as you'll see i'm going to be throwing all of the stuff on the screen for you guys right now i'm reading it through it's very very there's not like much or anything or any confirmed date but they, uh, the main question was, oh wait, we've got some music to build into it. This isn't any of my editing, by the way. This is just Fjorda. Uh, ready? We're hyping ourselves up. Here we go. It's not very, it's not that hyped. It's not that hyped at all. But yeah, so where is the gameplay? So they said, we'll be showcasing gameplay shortly before the release. It said, is that all you've done? And they said, no, we've done so much more, but we're just showing you a glimpse behind the curtain. You'll see uh, see more in the weeks ahead when we get uh, and when we get to launch as well. So if um, the Ark Survival Evolved, the game we're obviously playing right now, servers are closing on that. We know that official date is the 31st of August when all of the servers are shutting down. I can't believe it. It feels so weird saying it. Um, and so the game will probably release sort of mid August um, to mid to late August around about the server shutting down. So the gameplay trailer will most likely be coming around about sort of like early August time, maybe potentially July. Um, if you've been um, obviously in the art community for a long time, like myself, you will know that wildcard are usually a little bit late to a few things so don't expect the gameplay earlier than um you know earlier than expected but um you know i'm guessing it's going to be sort of august time um i am really looking forward to it personally obviously as well i I'm, i i threw up on the screen earlier you know what the uh you know some of the comparisons they're doing at the moment with um survival ascended and arc survival evolved and it, I mean, even when I play this version that I'm playing now, you still come onto it and you still can think it, you know, it's come a long way over a short, over, well, I say a short amount of time, over a few years, it has come a long way. Like, don't get me wrong, there's still so many bugs, but the way the game looks, the, you know, the sort of, the it still has the lag and stuff uh, and the frame rate, but nowhere near as much as it used to be from the start. And when they were comparing it to a tree, you still come over to, you you know this tree on the you know i'm not not the unreal engine 5 version and you still think for a game in you know that's been out for a long time and we're in 2023 now it still looks pretty cool i can't believe i've come onto the game to literally stare at a tree but um uh, you know because that's what the, the comparison like wildcard did recently but in the new version it generally does look so cool like it looks so realistic and the tiniest things i saw so many people in the comment section saying like uh yay a tree thanks wildcard and to be honest that was a little bit like that as well but they're going to be showing us different comparisons i think the main thing we all want as like a community is why does this why did i think that was a like a giant rex for a second from back here um but like i think the main thing we all want as a community is we want to see creature comparisons obviously the landscape and seeing what it all looks like uh, in the new version is all great and that you know i'm definitely looking forward to it but we want to see creature comparisons we want to see all of that stuff and that is what wildcard did say they said um that we're this uh, in the most recent one we were taking a look at the foliage that's been remastered in arc survival ascended that's why they've gone for the trees um and captured in unreal engine 5 
things are really sprucing up. They have little little uh, joke from them there. Not that great, to be honest. Sorry, Wildcard. Um, but keep an eye out on the future community crunches because every other week we'll be revealing new assets so you get an artistic impression of what a remaster means in Ark Survival as well. Uh, Ark Survival Ascended. Do you, guys, how long do you reckon it's going to take me to get over the fact of saying Ark Survival Evolved Ascended? Like, it's going to, like, I reckon it's going to be until the launch it's probably going to take me to get used to saying welcome back to an Ark Survival Ascended video it just doesn't feel right it just doesn't feel right um, considering I've been saying the same Ark Survival Evolved for the last couple of years but so expect a gameplay trailer guys um, coming in so where are we now we're in May so June July August it's so close literally three months to go um until well three and a half i would say and until the game actually is getting released so as i said two months there's always a chance that's when the gameplay will be coming but if i were to give any advice to anyone that's playing the first game at the moment on official or anything like that then i wouldn't say keep grinding out as much i know it's hard to stop saying stop grinding because you don't want to lose everything um but enjoy your final couple of months of playing the game because as i said we've literally got three months to go until the new game launches and the servers will be shutting down so that's why i'm mainly as a player myself i'm just enjoying um uh, unofficial with friends i've been doing that for the last like two years anyway um just because i was expecting arc 2 to come out and i haven't you know when you're like on the grind on official and you're like i'm not sure i was at that point where I was like, i'm not sure if i'm going to carry on because i don't know if i can put all the time into it with, with another game coming out and them closing down the servers and then it was like two years later and they're only just closing down now but what what just happened why did I, it sound like i took damage and then i just flew i mean that's still some arc stuff that happens to, the, to this day should we go in here see if the ferrazino wants to eat us this could be our little home. No, but generally, I'm looking forward to just seeing what all these maps look like on the new one. I'm looking forward to seeing what all the new creatures are going to look like. Obviously, the Fazalosuchus, um is the first creature coming to Scorched Earth um, uh, on day one. So we're going to be seeing... I, that's why I should have probably done this video on the island or scorched earth because that they're the first two we're going to be seeing like we won't see fjorda probably for quite a long time in the unreal engine 5 version as they've said they're going to be releasing them in different stages throughout the year um so just bear in mind all the content we've had on this version of arc so survival evolved what um, Arc 2's plan for the end of 2024. So all of that content that we've had in the last eight years of this game will be slowly released into that game in that sort of how many how how long is it? End of 2024. So in in a year and a half, all of the content from this version will slowly be added in through DLC drops, um, big updates, and everything like that. So that's the way Wildcard have said they're going to be doing it, and uh, we're going to be seeing a, we're going to be we, we're going to be seeing these battles, battles. We're going to be having UTs. We're going to be having them, but all in Unreal Engine Five. But I know there's still some people out there that are like, you know, it's a cash grab and everything. But I generally have changed my mind and not just as a content creator. I don't want anyone thinking like, oh, Dom, you're a YouTube content creator that makes arc videos. Of course, you're going to want the game to do well. Of course I am. Yeah, that's for sure. But if you if you saw my first reaction to the first roadmap, that was the most disappointed I've ever, ever been in my seven, well, eight years of being an arc content creator. I actually, I don't think I've ever been that like really annoyed about something. And then when wildcard changed the roadmap they talked about what's happening they told us how and showed us how big some of the changes are going to be of the second game then they said the dlcs are all going to become part of the bundle that was one of the biggest things that really annoyed me with the game is the fact they were going to try and recharge us for dlcs we've all paid for again um but it's a remaster and i'm more than happy to pay for a remaster which is going to bring um, which i've done in the past with many games which is meant to make the game better see 
it in a whole new light. And not only that, getting mods and new content we've not even had in Ark Survival Evolved before. So I'm looking at it as it's a whole brand new game. It's a remaster. There's so much to look forward to. And generally, I have actually never had such a turn of like thoughts in my head about a new game. I mean, I was so upset and disappointed and now I'm just ready to actually begin official again. I would never, I can't believe I'm even saying that. I wasn't going to start official until Arc 2, but I think it's going to happen, guys. So, anyway, thank you very much for watching today's video. It was more of a let's talk, just like, you know, old school 2010 YouTube Call of Duty gameplay commentary type video. Uh, where we just talk about events and uh, obviously show off uh, the new information that the devs have given us. So we've flown all the way back to where we were and uh, I'm going to be ending off the video here. Please make sure to put in any questions you want to ask me or anyth and anything I possibly can answer I will be doing. We're not far away from launch now. Thank you for watching guys. Leave a like, subscribe and I'll see you in my next video very soon.